Wait, hold up. Non-profit? So who did I get my $20 to then? What? Never mind that. Hold up. Hold up. Hey. What's good, y'all? What's good, y'all? My name is Simpistotle, and today I am bringing you with a brand new Pokemon fan game called Pokemon Comet. And yes, there is a comment in the background. Wait, hold on. The forest is on fire. I just peeped that. Yo. Ooh, what? Yo, they are going crazy with this background music. But yes, yo, this is a brand new Pokemon fan game that I see my boy Terrific was playing. And boy, does that game look beautiful. I seen a bunch of other people playing it. I seen these crazy thumbnails and I was like, you know what? I need to try this shit out. So I checked out evexpo.com and there it was. And apparently this game has new Fakemon called Fallen Pokemon. And it has like new mega evolutions and shit like that. And it also has like a whole new region for us to take a look at and explore. So with that being said, let's see what this game is about. They got some like evil niggas called like Team Space and shit. And I guess this might take place since it's called Pokemon Comet. This might take place in like space or something like that. So without further ado, let's see how this whole Comet shit takes place. I said place about like 40 times in this intro so i hope y'all enjoy it leave a like down below download link will be in the description below as well peace i mean no not not peace i'm not gonna lie bro that intro was really really that that beat was really crazy the zyro region a vast area where people and pokemon lived in harmony and unison from open waters to the sky scraping mountains and to even the rolling hills bitch how a hill roll hold up they got hills got wheels and shit in this region Hills can move in this region. Hold on. The region was at its most peaceful, especially with rolling hills and scraping mountains. Professor Coastal. That's, a, that's one hell of a professor name, bro. Right? Hold on. <laughs> Head researcher on Pokemon DNA was greeted by Professor Elm from the Johto region for a new discovery that he had recently uncovered. Dot, dot, dot. What did he uncover? Oh, shit. This shit is serious. Oh, Professor Coastal. Hey, uh, 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 uh. Ah. all righty, Elm. What was it that you're so eager to tell me? I mean, you even insisted on coming all the way over here instead of talking over the phone and shit, bro. Like, you, this better be super important because I got two new niggas that's supposed to be coming over here to be able to take over my whole Pokemon regime. I believe I've discovered something incredibly new. That might be right up your alley. Oh? Huh. Do tell. Now you have me curious. It actually might be better if I just show you. Wait, what? He got them shits right there on him? Oh. 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 Three new mods? What are all these? If my understanding is correct, I'm hypothesizing that these are all fallen Pokemon. What? Nani? Wait, are you are you like dead ass, my nigga? Fallen Pokemon. So, what you doing? Like, go pop them inside the fucking healing machine that I got right here, bro. What you talking about, fallen, big? Where they fell from? The stairs? Where they Kuina from? Um, got that One Piece? What makes them more? What makes them even more interesting is that they were all found outside of Zyro. Oh, <laughs> word, really? Fallen? And they can't get up? They were found near my lab by the person I mentioned a couple of days ago. Bitch, I, you reside in Zyro? I thought you resided in like Johto. He probably on a like, mission or vacation mission type thing. Remember? The one that wants to be a field researcher for you? Wait, what? Oh shit, they talking about me. Oh wow, Elm. This is indeed quite the discovery. Sure, I'd be glad to take them off your hands. Although, I've never heard of fallen Pokemon being found outside of Zyro. I have to look into this further. Oh, 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 right. I almost forgot to mention. But thank you for taking in another field researcher. They asked to help me out with my own research, but I'm not currently in need of a new assistant right now because I got two other dickheads. As a matter of fact, I got three other dickheads. The third one just doesn't even know that he's low-key my field researcher. I made him think that he stole my mind, but I got three of them in Johto right now. It's all good, Elm. I got you, my nigga. Uh, I'm glad you mentioned it. Since I was looking for an extra pair of hands anyways. Damn, these professors are so damn lazy, bruh. They always want 
youngins like me to be doing fucking work just so the paperwork is easier um could you describe them a little for me oh so this is us okay okay hey 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 okay uh so this is the boy and this is the girl oh wait of course this is the boy and this is the girl because they got i got boom this right over here y'all look at that nice little um that should have popped up like in the beginning I, I actually just forgot to pop that shit right there but anyways we're gonna go with the boy the boy look hold on let me see the gal them she look actually kind of dope so i might nah 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 she look she look like them dreadful pokemon breeders bro i'm not gonna i don't fuck with the pokemon breeders like that hmm i'd like to know their name could you please tell me what their name is oh huh. huh what would i name this nigga what would i name this nigga wait hold up i know what i might name this little nigga so their name is a real nigga hell yeah there is <laughs> hell yeah it is okay so it's a new trainer that's called a real nigga <laughs> okay got it so how soon can i meet them does right now work you can come on in what bitch i'm already here hey what's good you're Jeez, Elm, you're one step ahead of me once again. But greetings, a real nigga. <laughs> Such a stupid name. I hope you'll enjoy your stay. I have a spare room at my place that you can use while you're here. Oh, nice. Damn, Professor. Shoot, look at the time. I probably should be get, um should be getting back. Thanks a lot, Alani. I owe you one. Damn, full government name right there. Traveling from Johto to Zyro is a different experience, but a real nigga was excited nevertheless. Now staying at Professor Coastal's house. It only took a real nigga the rest of the day to finish settling in. Yeah, it only takes, y'all Y'all gotta keep that in mind, bro. It only takes a real nigga to be able to rest for the rest of the day to finish settling in, bro. <laughs> Even after such a short bit of time, it seems the journey has only just begun. I'm gonna have so much fun with this name. Time to experience the wonderful world of Pokemon. That was one hell of an intro. Whew. Hey, hey, so wait, hold on. So Professor Coastal is like my mom or some shit? Like, hold up. Okay. Crib look low-key kind of dope. We got way too many bookcases though. Hold up. Way, I must be like a Pokemon nerd geek, bro. Hold on. Because I really love to read. Look at this shit. What kind of um game console we got? Couldn't leave home without it. It looks like a regular old NES. Yeah, we really are very intelligent. Oh, who the fuck? Yo, Gardevoir is actually our mom. Damn. What's good, Gardevoir? It's Professor Coastal's Gardevoir. It seems to have a letter for you. What's good? What's this letter? Good morning, real nigga. Uh, sorry I couldn't be there right now, but I'm excited to have you become a real, f yeah, a field researcher. Before you leave, I left you with some very important items with my Gardevoir. They'll be pretty useful for your journey. Whenever you're ready, come meet me in my lab. I have a special gift for you. Okay, okay, down. What's good, Gardevoir? Vor Vor, what's good? Gardevoir seems to want to give you something. Okay, oh, nice. Pokey gear, cool. Has the Zyro. Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank for Arigato. Um, Konnichiwa. Thank you. Appreciate you. Yo, EXP fucking shit. You know how useful that is? What? Oh, damn. This shit. This place looks kind of dope. Who's this? Yo, hey. You're the one that just moved in with the professor, right? Are you really from Johto? What's it like over there? Oh, Zoe. Oh, damn. Zoe, what's good? Baby girl, you, you came over here with way too much, like, energy you gotta relax she probably has some coffee or some shit but still you have to like relax tone it down a little bit uh oh um sorry that's probably too much huh my name's zoe what's yours hmm it's nice to meet you real nigga or shall i say a real nigga i take it you're headed to the prof um to the professor lab right she's been constantly talking about you and something else but i can't remember what damn zoe you got like what short-term memory I, I hey listen no no like hate to that zoe because i i feel you on that kind of a little bit uh let's see i think it was something special about a pokemon group maybe I, I don't know but i've never seen her so excited in my life the professor's lab is just east of here wait where's east again uh north south east and west the way you're about my fault uh, i had to hit the high five real quick uh oh right i actually came to congratulate you on becoming a field researcher you were even willing to leave Johto, that beautiful last place. You wanted to come over to the Zyro region. You wanted to leave Johto. And you ain't, you wasn't even scared at all, baby girl. <laughs> Why you think they call me a real nigga? Because I'm a real nigga. Why would I be scared? 
to leave my hometown and come through a whole different new region full of like different cities and shit it's like fucking like probably moving to a whole different planet or some shit maybe being a field researcher means that you're also a trainer which also means that you get to raise pokemon of your own wow like a breeder maybe what you don't even have a pokemon to of your own yet well hurry on to the yeah if you would just like you know stop yap it oh wait we'll have a battle so we automatically became rivals yeah if she would have just stopped yapping to me and shit like that would have been had my starter but now i gotta peep out the, the neighbors what's good route one is north of here oh you don't say i heard a rumor that you could find a rare pokemon there but that's just what i know i think someone mentioned that it's not found in tall grass oh shit hold on in route one Oh, say less. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to check that shit out. Ah, hello, child. Care to spend some time with an old lady like me? You'd rather catch Pokemon? You say, yeah, bitch. <laughs> bitch, I don't know. You. I mean, I'm not gonna call her a bitch. I'm sorry. Ma'am, I'm so sorry. It's probably like her husband right up there. Oh, that's the professor's lab right there. Hold on. Chill. Let me see. Let me see. Let me peep out the whole shit. Who's this? Oh, hello. <laughs> I didn't see you there. Going on a journey, are you? If so, you might find this useful. Oh, what you got for me, cuz? Three orange berries. Hell yeah, that's gonna be useful for me. You know, I've recently been using orange berry. Oh, shit. Oh, she waiting for me. Hold on, man. Let me stop talking about orange berries and shit, bro. Y'all y'all know what's good about orange berries. Let me go inside this shit. Ah, hey, hey. Welcome, a real nigga. Sorry to have you starting so soon, but I'm so glad that you're joining my field research team. Oh, oh, so Zoe's a part of the team already? Damn, I'm I'm lacking. I'm slacking behind. It's a fairly new program that I have for new trainers. So there's only one other person right now. But you've probably already met her, huh? Yes, ma'am. Zoe, big little Zoe, bro. She she's she's a character. I'll let you know that for now. Zoe might be a little ahead of the game right now. But it don't let it but don't let it deter you away. Deter you away. Deter you away. I don't know if I say that right, but hey, you'll catch up in no time. <laughs> To get started, everyone should have a Pokemon with them, even field researchers. Stop calling me a field researcher. Just call me a trainer, next champion of the Zyro region. That's all you gotta call me, field researcher. I can't just go up to a shorty in the Zyro region and say, hey, look, I'm a field researcher. No, bitch, I wanna tell him I'm a Pokemon champion, you know, upcoming Pokemon champion. I was going to have you pick between one of the normal starters that I give out on, yeah, that I give out on Zyro, but after having some thought about it, I have a better idea. Remember those three rare Pokemon you found back in Johto? The ones currently on my desk right now, as you can see? I think it's better if I let you pick them. Oh shit, three rare Pokemon and they're fallen? <gasps> Say less, stop yapping. I don't give a damn about their goddamn origins. I probably should, should have read that. But hey, when I'm editing it, I'll slow it down so I can read it. And then next episode, if y'all care, I'll like, tell y'all all about the fallen the lore behind the fallen pokemon damn bitch you should at least let me like you know walk up over there and pick he's these bots bro my character is so goddamn eager to get himself a goddamn mom so let's see first pick right over here we got chikorita the fairy type <laughs> it's uh, yo it's it's cute. It's cute. I'm not even going to roast him, bro. <laughs> no, I'm not going to lie, man. Why is... I wasn't expecting it to be bald-headed, bro. Like, I, I fuck with the collar. The collar is cool, bro, but... <laughs> it, it looks so adorable. What? The bald-headed... Bald-headedness, like, fairy shit. Okay, I see you. I fuck with you, Chikorita. Let me see. Let's check out the Cinder Quill. Hold on. An electric type. Cyndaquil. I don't know. I don't speak for all Cyndaquils, nor do I speak for all Typhlosions. I seen that shit that happened with Typhlosion. Let me think on you real quick. I gotta pee. Big total. Big total dial. An ice type. Nigga, I see for alligator with ice fang, bro. I'm not. You know what? I'm not worried about that. Yo. Cyndaquil, how about you become my Pikachu in this uh in the Zyro region? I don't know how I messed up that entire sentence, but hey, we made it there. <laughs> um, but hey, do I want to give him oh you know what? Yeah, I do. Let's call him Picadil. Picadil reminds me of my um of this nice little restaurant I used to go to as a jit called Piccadilly. Ah, you've made your pick? 
Cyndaquil, an excellent choice. You sure about that? Uh, now that you have a Pokemon, I have something very important for you. Here, a Pokedex. Oh, nice. Um, Professor, can I get some Pokeballs to go with that Pokedex, if anything? Oh, God damn. Thank you, Professor. Shit, 20? Halcyon Town. Well, I feel like I've seen that name from somewhere. Battle her and head to Halcyon Town. Say less. The fuck is going on here? Um, hello? Is this a cutscene? Oh, bitch, I was about to say, no, never mind. I, I just bugged the fuck out. I gotta let the devs know about that. So, devs, if y'all are watching this, if anybody watches this right now, please let the devs know that when you come out the lab, it's like a somewhat of a 30 minute it's not really 30 minute but it's like a um it's, it takes a long time before it transitions back into like the regular shit but hold on let me before i even battled shorty let me peep the mon real quick don't quit the game <laughs> let me peep the mon real quick pick a deal yo you look clean as fuck for an electric type man look at that shit that boy he looked like a goddamn electric ghost type are there even electric ghost types and that boy knows voltaic I don't even know what Voltaic even means. What's good, Zoe? It's about time. Yep, chill, chill, chill. You know, I had to make a couple of choices here and there. I had to choose between the chick or Cyndaquil because I damn near wasn't gonna, I damn sure wasn't gonna get that goddamn ice type total doll. I wasn't gonna be stuck with no ice type goddamn for alligator. Oh, she didn't want to hear none of that. Damn, Zoe was good, shorty. Hey, she got a regular mon. Oh, you're fucked. Hold on. Use Leer. Make your defense go a little low. Yo, that shit. That shit packs a punch. No, chill, chill, chill. Use tackle. Okay, there we go. That. I don't do shit to him. Hold on. Fool. I had a potion this entire time, dickhead. Take. Please don't put me back in orange. Phew. Somehow I was like faster than this chick crazy she didn't see the fucking or she didn't see the potion coming out of nowhere oh i forgot i had orange berries i could easily like cook though with that shit but anyways displaying extra info blah 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 i don't need none of that shit what i look like oh listen i'm a real nigga bro that's that is pretty useful zoe look that is pretty useful i'm not gonna lie i'm and you're right i didn't know that at all but i'm not gonna need that shit whatsoever what i look like oh wait what Appreciate you. What if that shit spelt like spilt all in my face? You're so lucky. They're sort of hard to come by in the region, but mostly everyone knows about them. Strange to think it was found outside of Zyro, though. That settles it. Starting now, you're going to be my rival, real nigga. Why don't you just go get yourself a, um, a fallen starter? Wait, hold on. Oh, she's gonna grab other Pokemon to add to her team. Let me make sure she didn't get a fallen starter because I would be really cooked. Yo, Professor, since she didn't get one, let me at least get, like, two of the Fallen Starters. I know I'm I'm being, like, you know, greedy and shit like that, but the Starters, the Fallen Starters, they was found literally right next to me. They was, like, it was dedicated to me. Why can't I have the Fallen Starter? And hold on, let me see something real quick. Hold up, wait a minute. Hey, y'all thought that I was finished? Let me. God damn, you, of course, would know much that. Bitch, bro. Wait, and she didn't even heal my mind? That's crazy. Look, there's a gem right here. Grass gem. I'm not gonna need that shit. The fuck am I gonna need a grass gem for? Alright, now that we're in route one. Alright, now that we're in route one, let's see what they got. What else they got going on in here? Ooh, Ricky D say less. Ooh, the team already looking good. But then wait, hold on. I also gotta find yo, chill out, chill out, chill out. You ain't gotta do all that. I also gotta find that rare Pokemon that they're talking about because they said. Rumor has it, of course, that it's not found in rare, like, not rare, yeah. Rumor has it that it's not found in tall grass, you feel me? Call that boy Kook. There you go, Kook. Uh, can I check out my encounters here? Can I peep the encounters? Yeah, I can. I've only seen, like, two mons, bitch. Yo, Jit, looks like you're trying to fight me. Ha <laughs> ha, got your ass. I know his ass is probably scared as hell. He didn't expect to see me. Boom, thunder shock, nigga. I bet your ass is shocked because of that, huh? Easy. Oh, why the fuck you even use Leer? You seen that I'm like casting thunder on you, dickhead? Why would you even use Leer on me like that? Pichu? It's a good thing I ain't sent out Kook. Ooh, chill, bro. Please. Come on, bro. Really? That should have fed me. I'm not gonna lie. I'm lucky I don't have like lightning rod as an ability. Goddamn. 
Damn, so I've searched the grasses like high and low and that rare mon, that bitch really is not inside them grasses, bruh. No cap. And I'm still missing three mons, bro. Them, them shits, they got like a rare percent chance. So anyways, let's just keep on with the adventure because this dude right here said that he suddenly realized that I just got a Pokemon. Well, actually, mind you, I just got two Pokemon, little nigga. <laughs> Oh shit, it looks like we both caught the same mons, nigga, but I got home claws on mine, dickhead. You use Leer all you want, bro. Bring that defense down, down a little bit, but still keep me in the green. Oh, you didn't accomplish anything, buddy. And you're going to send out a bug type right after that? Goodbye, my nigga. Thank you. Thank you for that free XP, boy. Thank you for wasting my fucking time. Oh, looky here. Oh, damn it. Dammy? What the hell is a dammy? I meant damn it. <laughs> dammy sounds like I'm trying to fucking be cute bro what the fuck i'm a real nigga bro what kind of real nigga says damn me bro no cap what is this sunflowers maybe if i did something with these never mind i thought the you know the rare pokemon will pop out of somewhere if i did something like that hmm where could that bitch be at bro can i hop skip and jump them two shits right there them two rocks yo please why would you even pull that Ooh, you lucky I didn't pull out the other nigga. Come on. School vet. Ooh, pick a dope. Please come out here. But yeah, guys, look. That bitch knows Shadow Sneak. This nigga is going to be a ghost. An electric ghost type, bro. I've never seen that a day in my life. I I think. I'm not sure. But electric ghost type, that shit sounds dope. Wait until my boyfriend finds out about this. How about this? Fuck your boyfriend, bitch. <laughs> what he gonna do? He don't see me hop, skipping, and jumping. Wait, hold up. Wait, hold up. Oh, it's you. I didn't expect to see this nigga here. Hold up. Easy, easy, easy. Wait, hold on. Ah, you're a bitch, bro. I thought this nigga was the goddamn freaking rare Pokemon. Greetings, traveler. I believe that I may have something of interest to you. In my po oh wait hold on in my possession is a very rare and unique Pokemon that cannot be found anywhere else. I'm very fond of the research and field work that comes with having a Pokédex. So if you could show me some info, I'll let you have this Pokemon. What do you say? Show him info? Sure. Great. Now then, let's get started. I'd like you to register Grubbin to your Pokédex. Let's see if you do. It doesn't seem like you own a fucking Grubbin. God damn it. What? <laughs> I might as well, bro. I might as well. I might as well. Whew. Please chill, 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 chill. I don't know about having an Azumaro. Shiny Azumaro added, bro, on the team. This is the very first shiny. And this is the, this is the very first episode. I wasn't expecting this. But anyways, let's see. All right, you little shit. There you go. I have your, your little dumb grubbing. Star fucking Ravia. Are you serious? I didn't even know Starlies even existed in this shit. I'm, where am I gonna find a Star Ravia from? Fuck that whole stupid dumbass mind, bro. I'll come, I'll come back for that shit. Maybe I might come back for it. Now I got a goddamn grubbing on my team. My girlfriend doesn't battle all oh, shit. That that was your girlfriend who I stomped, smashed over there. Show her how much stronger I am than her. Wait, what? The fuck? Weak ass nigga. If you don't take a dumb, ugly ass up on somewhere. Damn, that does nothing to him. Okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. Okay, there we go. Now we talking. Now we talking. Full restore? Rich ass nigga. Thank you for the two free restores of hits that you gave me. And you gave me 1,200 bands too? I would have been embarrassed if I was your GF. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for Pokemon Comet. Let me know what you guys thought about this game right here. This has been a fantastic fan game i'm actually really loving the um fallen pokemon that i've seen well well the starter and well you know i'm actually really glad that we got our very first shiny which i tried to test inside the cave behind me and that bitch really almost got one shot by a goddamn sand shrew so let's see what happens in the next episode if you guys want to see an episode two of pokemon comet let the likes speak for themselves uh if we get about like five likes then i'll make an episode two um, if not, let me know what you guys want to see me play. I hope you guys enjoyed. Link in the description will be, um, download link will be in the description below for you guys to enjoy the game yourselves. 
I will catch y'all in the next episode or the next video. Peace.